Hi, this is Dr. Paul from Amara Aesthetics and this is the next part in the lip injection fact file. Today's question is what is the best product for lip injections? So in our clinics in uh, Harley Street in London and also on Marion Square in Dublin, we only use Juvederm um, lip filler. So Juvederm have been around since about 2004, 2005 when they brought out their first uh, Juvederm lip filler. They had some other ones before that called Surgiderm, uh, but the reason why I like Juvederm is because they keep on updating their products, bringing out new products every couple of years. Some other companies, they kind of stick with the same product and they don't update things. Uh, Juvederm are the same guys who make Botox, um, so they, they make a lot of money from Botox. They plow a lot of that money back into research and development, making sure that they have the best products. Uh, okay, so the reason why I choose Juvederm and the reason why anyone should choose a particular product, um, I'm gonna break that down into a few different reasons. The first reason is safety. So the most um, strict and stringent regulatory body that looks into uh, products that are made for, for lips and, and all sorts of drugs would be the FDA, uh, the Food and Drug Administration. So that's an American body. It costs a lot to have your, your product or your drug to go through that system. Um, I think it's something like $10 million to actually just go through the process and you mightn't even get approved at the end of all that. Um, so any product that's FDA approved um, means they've gone through extra hoops that you don't need to go through in other territories, even in the EU. Um, all of Juvederm's products are FDA approved uh, and that's one reason why I like them and that um, guarantees much more safety. Secondly, I like to choose a product that has a lot of data that's been around a lot. Um, Juvederm would be one of the most famous products and for lip fillers it's been around for a long time, it's been used I think more than any other product. Um, with the exception of perhaps Restylane, I'm not sure which one wins in that, but they've built, both been used a lot and because Juvederm has been used a lot, I think that means you know that a lot of people have tried it and there still haven't been problems found. Thirdly, I think it's very important to choose a product that is a hyaluronic acid. Um, years ago in the 90s and 80s, people used to use collagen-based fillers, which was technically something that was taken from an animal. It was um, either pig or cow derived. They took it from the skin and they processed it, but essentially you were getting a transplant of material taken from a cow or a pig. Um, so of course people had allergic reactions to that. Uh, the latest products are hyaluronic acid and they're completely synthetic. Juvederm's products are, sy are synthetic and for that reason you can be quite um, reassured that you're not going to have an allergic reaction to them. The next reason I choose Juvederm's products is because they are mixed in with a local anaesthetic. So uh, if there isn't a local anaesthetic in your filler, then it just feels a little bit more stingy when it's being injected in. So it really just takes the edge off the pain. Finally, the reason why I like Juvederm's latest Vicross products is because they have three features that are really important in, um, in a lip filler. Uh, they provide decent structural support so you can change the shape and increase the size of lips with that extra structural support. Um, they're very soft and more watery than other products, so you're much less likely to have firm nodules or lip, uh, lumps or anything like that. Uh, and finally, despite being more watery and softer, they have the technology that allow them to stay longer in the skin. So they last long enough that um, you get a decent time out of it, like a year, year and a half, but not too long, because if something lasts too long on the lips or in the body, your body eventually figures out that it's not supposed to be there and starts to get a bit more aggressive at trying to get rid of it. So with permanent fillers, you know, ones that last for five or ten years or more, your body can have a, a very serious um, inflammatory response. That's not really possible with products that only last a year, year and a half, so uh, the duration is very important. Okay, so that was a video about um, what's the best product for lip filler injections. I hope that was really helpful. If you have any questions, please ask them below. Don't forget to uh, subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.